Now, Curry's finance minister, Yui Lo, says the new tax code will be revised in a way that would encourage firms to hire more workers, despite the ongoing corporate restructuring. Our parliamentary correspondent, Shin Semin, has more on the finance chief's explanation of the new tax code revisions at a meeting of the ruling Senate Party and the government. The new tax code will be more employment friendly, according to Finance Minister Yu Ho. During a meeting with the ruling Senate Party and the government on Thursday, Yu said the revisions to taxes set to take effect starting next year will focus on revitalizing the country's economy as well as making more jobs. Yu said the revised tax rule will help minimize the fallout from the government's ongoing corporate restructuring drive and help lower the burden on workers at small and mid sized firms. Despite Britain's exit from the European Union sparking uncertainties at home and abroad, the top economic policymaker added that the revised tax code will help stimulate local economy and stabilize the people's livelihoods. While pressing for a swift parliamentary handling of the issue, the finance ministry said the revised tax code will soon be submitted to the National Assembly. In addition to the tax law revision, the minister also rolled out his vision on job creation through the government's supplementary budget during a separate meeting with the financial policy advisors. He projected that the extra government fund will help generate at least 60,000 more jobs. Adding that the supplementary budget will focus on restructuring and mainly assisting employment, you said the money will also support specific social groups, including senior citizens, to find jobs. He also said the government will mobilize all means to push its plan of putting more than 17 billion U.S. dollars to resuscitate the local economy in the latter half of the year, even if that means expanding policy loans. Shin Zemin, Arirang News.